Me and Kat have always been close. She used to terrorise me to no end. <laughs> it was never, oh, Mike, you'll be okay. Come play with us. I was found in a gooseberry bush. <laughs> and and I, was, I was adopted. You, all those lovely, lovely uh, sister-like words you'd expect. She got an apple to the forehead once in return, though, so. You know, we grew up together. We learned together. We helped each other, and we've always been there for each other. She's had a bad times, but she's pulled through and really worked hard to make a great life for herself. And I've watched her grow into somebody that I'm really, really proud to call my sister. I know Dad was proud of you. He always spoke about you and he always lit up whenever you came home. <laughs> he's definitely here with us today. Probably where he's kept the, where the, where the wine's kept or <laughs> he's doing some lunges somewhere or something like that. I don't know. He'd want me to tell you how beautiful you looked. <laughs> you look absolutely stunning. It was so funny when you came to see me, me and my dad that day to ask us for permission. You kind of just said, uh, I'm going to ask Kat to marry me. Uh, <laughs> are, you, are you okay with that? <laughs> me and Dad were, were all acting cool and chill, like we had all authority and all that. <laughs> we were just like, yeah, 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 okay. Yeah. <laughs> we're, we're, we're all right with that. We all welcome you into our family, Chris, and we all love you as one of our own already. You're basically the male version of Kat. <laughs> And I'm not sure if that's a compliment. <laughs> and if she turns up with a new bag, no matter how small it is, don't ask her how much it costs. Catherine, I promise to give you my love and friendship. To be there for you when you need me most. To be there for you when you need me most. <gasps> to laugh with you, to cry with you. To laugh with you, to cry with you. To confide in you, to trust you. To confide with you and trust you. To comfort you and to support you. To comfort you and to support you. All that I have, I share with you. All that I have, I share with you. I <laughs> promise to respect you and I, be faithful always. I promise to respect you and be faithful. Yeah. <laughs> Try to forget the heart there. She really is watching you. <laughs> you got that. <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> These promises I make to you. These promises I make to you. For the rest of my life. The rest. Of my life. <laughs> <laughs> Catherine, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love and affection. As a symbol of my love and affection. And in recognition. And in recognition. Of our shared life together. Of our shared life together. Wear it with a feeling of love and joy. Wear it with a feeling of love and joy. I choose you to be my husband. I choose you to be my husband. <laughs> this day and every day. This day and every day. My darling wife. It was the first time I've actually said that. <laughs> she goes by a few names. Cat, Catherine, Cat with a cake. And a personal favourite of mine, Sausage Pants. <laughs> She's an amazing person inside and out and brings the best out of me without even knowing it. She's always setting herself goals, whether it's not eating chocolate for a month, believe it or not, <laughs> or running half a marathon. No matter what, she will strive to succeed in anything she tries. But at the same time, if she fails, and not often she does, she'll just shrug it off with a saying, can't be good at everything. <laughs>
Just one of the many reasons I, why I fell in love with her. <laughs> yeah. Chris is one of the best men I've ever met. And he's always been there for me. And he's got a heart almost as big as his nose. <laughs> is that off you? Is that off it? How lovely does the bride look? Cat's brilliant, she's hard working, strong, positive. And that's just a few words to describe her. And if she has the same amount of determination for this marriage as she does for a 6 a.m. selfie, <laughs> they're gonna last forever. Ever! Funny, beautiful, glamorous, independent, but also so loving. Always caring for others and adding sparkle to everyone you meet. <laughs> Just like you do every day in my life. She's been through some tough times recently, but although feeling so down herself, she was always there to support others around her. I'm so lucky to have met her when I did, and even luckier to have kept hold of her for so long. Well, she's stuck now anyway. <laughs> And just to think, if I didn't own a BMW at the time when we started dating, we possibly wouldn't be here now, so... But, all jokes aside, all jokes aside, today I'm married my best friend. She's the love of my life and will be for the rest of my life. Now you can all please stand and raise a glass for my beautiful wife, Mrs Haycock. Right, that's enough from me. Chris said, if I do good at this speech, I could be his best man at the next wedding. Yeah!